The fastest selling pill in history was born without its makers knowing what it would be used for. Researchers were working in the sleepy Kent town of Sandwich, an unlikely spot for a sexual revolution. They started a search 12 years ago for a chemical capable of relaxing blood vessels. It was like looking for a key to fit in a lock. The blood vessels they were trying to relax were those around the heart, relieving the pain caused by blockages in patients with angina. A million and a half patients in Britain suffer from angina. If the researchers could find the right chemical key, they could be launching a new pill into a market worth a billion pounds a year. After screening 1,500 compounds, they found their chemical key. Then they tried it on volunteers, until the doctor in charge noticed side effects. The question was whether we should continue dosing, whether we should increase the dose, or whether the study should be discontinued at that point. And almost as an aside, he mentioned that uh, a proportion of the volunteers at the high doses had recorded um, penile erection. But the company weren't looking for an erection pill. Another promising chemical looked destined for the pharmaceutical graveyard. It wasn't that the drug didn't work. It did relax blood vessels by blocking a specific chemical process in the body. It's just that that process wasn't happening in the heart. <laughs> 